What's up guys, this is Jeff here with Sparta Media Group and I wanted to take a brief moment to talk about all the exciting products that we offer here at Sparta Media Group. Whether you're a small business or a large business and beyond, we offer it all. We are your one-stop shop for promotional items. We build video content, we build YouTube pre-roll, we do graphic design, we do screen printing and t-shirts, we wrap vehicles, we create vinyl banners, direct to mailers, and business cards and so much more. To learn a little bit about Sparta MG, click the link below and follow me. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for our sixth bout of the evening and is set for three two-minute rounds in the super flyweight division. <clears throat> Introducing first, fighting out the dynamic mortgage concepts red corner, please put your hands together for Bailey Winter. All right, guys, very exciting. Our very own Bailey Winters making the long walk to the ring been preparing very hard and she's always in absolutely incredible shape. Can't wait to see what performance she puts on here tonight. We also want to give a shout out to our sponsor Sparta Media Group at SpartaMG.com for sponsoring the pre-fight interviews. And her opponent fighting at Larry H. Miller Auto Group Blue Corner, please welcome Malia Paculon! And her opponent, just 19 years old, Malaya Pakulon, is, is prepared and ready to bring the action. She comes from a great camp and she has great technical speed. This should be a barn burner. We're gonna go ahead and take a look at the tail of the tape, sponsored by Larry Miller, Chrysler Dodge, Fiat of Denver, driven by you. Take a look at it, a substantial age advantage from Aliyah, just 19 years old, but Bailey with the height advantage and the experience. Ladies and gentlemen, this super flyweight bout is brought to you by All Drivers Insurance. Let's meet our fighters first. Fighting out the Dynamic Mortgage Concepts Red Corner from Denver, Colorado, representing Easton Training Center, Bailey Winters! And her opponent, fighting out Larry H. Miller Auto Group Blue Corner from Guadalupe, California, representing Stick and Move, Malia Lady Pac-Man! Pacculon! Okay, ladies, we went over all the rules. Remember, nothing all right, here behind, the nothing come low. To the center. Let's touch here them we up. go. Let's We're ready for this. Super flyweight elimination boxing action. Referee Stephen Blair. My man Cody back. Oh, well, I have a guest here at the ringside table. Jeff hopping back on the table with me for this. Oh, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to cut myself off there. They are immediately going at it. Uh, the girls never fail. They're always putting on a show. Wow. Bailey using that reach immediately. This is what I knew was going to happen again. As I said on the pre-show, Sparta fighters, they're not just boxers. They're not just kickboxers. They know everything, and Bailey is no exception. Yeah, absolutely. Malaya, just 19 years old. Look at the tech, the 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 raw power. Yeah, stick and move boxing has produced. It's really starting to produce some great, great boxers in the state of Colorado. Yeah, absolutely. Excellent head movement. Look at the aggression. Wow. Bailey seems to have a hard time dealing with the aggression right now, but she will settle in. She's got enough experience. She knows what to do here. Of course. I mean, with any with any fight, you know, it, it's staying calm for the initial rounds, not exerting too much energy, being patient. Bailey has a history of doing that very, very well. Yeah, absolutely. It's starting to settle in a little bit. We're starting to see a little bit more technical movement. 
The head movement for Malaya has been good. Bailey needs to start using her jab and getting in range. There you go. There's a really good one. Bailey look, oh, big right hook there by Bailey. Look how patient Bailey's being. She's not, she's not necessarily going for any strikes herself. She's a lot of times waiting for Malia to swing. Oh, and a big overhand right by Lady Pac-Man. I don't know about you, Cody, but I'm super impressed with the 19-year-old. Wow. Trippy, I'm going into this. I didn't even know that, and I'm even more impressed right now. Under the bright lights, a sold-out crowd in a yes. debut. Wow. I mean, Jefferson County Fairgrounds, first event of the year, in the, in the middle fight of the card. This is unbelievable, and they are not disappointing so far. Bailey seems to be getting in rhythm there. Wow, I don't know about you, Cody. I give that first round to Malia. Yeah, I mean, she was definitely the aggressor. She controlled that round. She Bailey lands some good shots coming off of some wild strikes by Malia, but I'm, I'm impressed by both of them. Yeah, it was, uh, <laughs> the women never disappoint, right? No. It's like somebody just lights a fuse and there they go. And look at this too. Malia, no stool, just hands up. And it, let's check out the replay here. Big right hook, wow, that rocked Bailey, but Bailey, Keeps her composure, doesn't get out of control, doesn't throw anything wild, presses off and gets back in the fight. Absolutely. Shout out to Larry Miller, Chrysler Dodge Fiat of Denver for sponsoring the instant replay this evening. Got a car from them myself. Great dealership, <laughs> honestly. <laughs> They're <Yeah>. great there. <laughs> yeah, they are. And I think they know we're easy sales, Cody. Yeah, yeah, I, I agree. Well, round two, here we go. Uh, Bailey looks composed. She took some good direction in her corner. She's great at following coach instruction. Um, so we'll see, but man, Malia came out like a cannonball. We'll see if that continues now. Malia, the very, uh, almost an awkward southpaw. She almost fights even. Yeah, oh, Malia. big hook by Malia. A crowd favorite tonight as well. Yeah, these ladies sold some tickets. <laughs> You know, Cody, she's doing an excellent job of avoiding the big punches from Bailey. Look at the head movement. Bobbing and weaving. Yes, yes. Bailey needs to settle into that jab a little more. Good combination by Bailey, but here comes Malia. Look at wow. this. Just unloading on each other. My goodness, I've been waiting for a fight like this tonight. Oh, my goodness. This is so exciting when it gets going back and forth like this. Not a break in action. No, not at all. Bailey, I mean, Bailey's had the has the significant reach advantage. Once she can settle into that reach, it's gonna be a totally different fight. I bet our friend Todd Romero's laying on the couch right now. Oh yeah, yelling at the TV <laughs> screen. We got you, buddy. We got you. We're covering for oh, you tonight. Oh, of course. It's just like when you think there's gonna be a low on the action. Here we go. Good, good step hook by uh, Bailey. But look at Malia come right back on the firing. ropes now. And, and very, very heads up by Malia. As soon as she's in that clinch, immediately getting Bailey to the rope in the corner. Absolutely. Good right hand by Bailey. Malia's doing just such a great job of the head movement. I mean, look at her. She's avoiding a lot of it. She's rolling with the punches. Oh, big overhand miss there by Malia. That might have been it. 30 seconds left now in this second round. It's a pretty even round, so whoever, somebody can steal this. There you go, good. Bailey now by getting Bailey. Malia into the corner. She's using her distance. And now Malia well. comes back. Oh my God. Woo! Oh, <laughs> big left. Much better round for Bailey in this one, really settling down. I think we got it 1 1 going wow. into the third round. I, I agree. Bailey answered very well. That's. Like, that's just an experienced fighter. After the first round, feeling stuff out, doesn't get crazy, listens to her coaches, sits back and does what she does best. Uh, Cody, I got to laugh because Todd texts me, loving this fight. There it is. <laughs> hey, look, hey, shout out to Todd Romero. Super fan, couldn't be here tonight, recovering. We love you, baby. Let's check out this replay here. Massive overhand left by Lady Pac-Man. Wow, the, I mean, the fact she can generate that much power, I mean, she really puts her whole body into it, but that's what you gotta do against a bigger lady like Bailey. It's just, it's just like little little Manny Pacquiao, right? Exactly. They're so small, but 
My goodness, I've always been fascinated how the shorter boxer closes distance yes. and lands the big shots. Exactly. Nobody did it better than Mike Tyson in the 80s. 100%. Manny Pacquiao through four decades now. True. Yeah, he the did, man, yeah. The man's timeless. He's been around for a while. Um, <laughs> but I can't say it enough. I mean, Malia being 19 years old, the composure, she's taking excellent direction from her corner. Bailey's pumped up. She's ready to go. You know she's either going out on her shield or in on it. I mean, there, there's... She's gonna come guns a blazing. This is the round that is gonna determine the winner because Bailey is an incredibly conditioned fighter. She's in amazing shape. Yeah. And she's not disappointed so far, landing some big shots. Ooh. Just missing that huge overhand. Ooh, wow! Big combination by Malaya. Don't blink, fans, I swear. She is doing an incredible oh. job of just moving in and out and side to side. Oh, <laughs> oh good counter, uppercut. Bailey's got her now. Oh, and Malia very, very adept, gets out of the corner. She has beautiful footwork. I mean, oh, she is moving out of there. You said this girl's 19? 19 years old. My God. That's what's so exciting about the next decade, my friend. <laughs> my Lots of young talent. I'll tell you what, and they're starting off right, fighting for Sparta and airtight. Oh, big shot there by Bailey. 48 seconds left. This could be a split decision. We yes. could be heading to a split. I'm gonna go ahead and flip this coin here, Jeff, and uh, that's how I'm gonna pick the winner. <laughs> Can we get uh, another round with overtime? Yes, I agree. Is oh that, you're the boss, aren't you? Why don't you get in there and tell them what to do? <laughs> 30 seconds now. Oh my goodness, what a fight. Bailey immediately pressing Malia into the corner. This is where her conditioning should pay off for her. But every time Malia looks like she takes a deep breath, she comes guns a-blazing, yeah. throwing these huge shots. 10 seconds now. Oh. Do they try to end this fight? Oh, they're gonna go. Here we go. Here we go. Strap in. Big shots by both of them. Wow, wow. I'm just impressed. Just great fight. Great fight. Wow. One more round. One more <laughs> round. Oh, we're gonna need overtime there. What a fight. What a fight. Unbelievable fight by both ladies. I mean, we can't say it enough. Again, Malia, 19 years old, fighting Bailey, who's got 10 years on her and a lot of experience. We're going to take a look at the monitor, the move of the fight presented by Rocky View Dental Implant Center. Just a great fight by both of these ladies. It's going to be close. I'm very interested to see what the scorecards say. I think we could have a split decision that could go either way, and rightfully so. Both these women fought very hard tonight. The judges' scorecards are taking a while to get in, which tells me that this is a very hard fight to score. We are going to take it up to the ring announcer. Big Mo with the decision coming up now. Ladies and gentlemen, after three full rounds, we go to the judges' scorecard for a decision. Judge Vantine scores a 30-27, while judges Martinez and Ramirez score 29-28. Declaring your winner by unanimous decision, Malia Lady Pac-Man Pac-Culon. Malia with a victory, very impressive at 19 years old. What a performance by both of these ladies. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm joined by our winner. Hold up, hold up. Uh, who's a fan of, of Lady Pac-Man right here?
That's, that's, that's what I thought. I wasn't sure if I could hear you. Now, Malia, <laughs> what an incredible fight. You were an aggressor going in, landed some massive shots. Was that your plan going into this fight to be the aggressor? Yes, definitely. It was my plan to go in, aim for the body, but I was getting grabbed on a little too much to go for the body, so I had to use my power, you know? Now, as I learned just a couple seconds ago, it sounds like you have some fans in the building tonight. Anything you want to say to them? Um, definitely to my family, Mara and Aaron Wolf. I just want to thank you guys so much for everything you guys did for me, because if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be in this ring right now. And this goes out to you guys, and I promise when we go to the top, you guys are coming with me. So, I think I speak, I think I speak for everyone tonight that I'm, I'm curious, so uh, what's next? The top. I like that answer. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your winner, Malia Lady Pac-Man Pacular.